This corkscrew baluster was cast in one pound virgin foam, cut on the 8700 CNC turntable and 3000 shaper machines. To get an extra smooth surface, we'll use some medium grit sandpaper on the foam. We will coat the foam with a two-part epoxy hard coat to give the form a longer life as well as a smoother surface and this will allow us to use any concrete release agent. The epoxy is brushed on and left the required time to dry. A light sanding is done to ensure a smooth surface and a second coat of epoxy is applied. The baluster mold halves are strapped together and then we warm up some clay in the microwave. The clay is smoothed into the seams to keep any of the wet concrete mixture from escaping and it gives the finished piece a much cleaner edge. Once the baluster mold is all strapped in place, it's time to fill the mold. The wet mixture is poured into the cavity and it is jiggled at several stages to make sure it fills out all the corners of the mold. After leaving the concrete to cure overnight, we demold the piece, being careful not to damage the form, because this form could be used over and over again. The piece emerges according to the design, 